tell the world about your future plans. Today is decision day. Plus, DHS continues showing appreciations for teachers and staff. And find a career opportunity virtually. How you can learn more about the construction industry. GTD News starts right now. Today, many students have made choices on what they want to do after high school. It's decision day. Good morning, Davison. I'm Haley Croft. And I'm Jack Belosic. Some of these seniors have already made their decision well known. Chloe Evoy is heading to Saginaw Valley, and Tyler Louis Luel is now at Ma Mikel Stone will be joining to Grand Valley, and Morale Mor Morton is taking classes at, at MSU. Paul Bador is whizzing away to Michigan Tech, and Adrian Nellett will head up to Northern Michigan. Congrats to all, and feel free to keep sharing your decisions with us on Twitter. Find us at DTV underscore official. These weeks, these weeks, we've been showing our appreciations for teachers that we love. All of us have been affected by a teacher or staff members. So this week, make sure to let your favorite teacher know how much you, they've impacted you. So who is your favorite teacher and why? Um, I really love Mr. Schuster. I've had him for like three years of my high school experience. He's really awesome. Um, he's always giving kids like new opportunities to learn things and life advice like every day during class. Um, he's always like making kids strive to be better and giving them like ways to be better as musicians. And I think that's really awesome. Schuster's a good choice. He's great. He is. <laughs> All right. So who's your favorite teacher here at DHS and why? Uh, it's probably Mr. Prim, because I spent a lot of time with him for Science Olympiad. Mm. Who's your favorite he teacher here at DHS and why? Uh, Goki, because she is very funny and she has a really great uh, teaching attitude. Right, thank you. So who's your favorite teacher here at DHS? I'd have to say Mr. Prim. Why is that? Because he's great. Is there any other reason I need? That's a fair enough answer, to be honest. Yeah. So who's your favorite teacher here at DHS and why? I would say Mrs. McGlashan. She's always been very genuine and enthusiastic about her subject, which I really appreciate. And she's always been very kind and helpful. So I think she's really great. All right, thank you. So who is your favorite teacher here at DHS? Uh, my favorite teacher is Mr. Schuster. Shout out to my homie Shoe Daddy. Can we fix it? Yes, we can. If you really like Bob the Builder and think construction is the career for you, there is a chance to talk to industry professionals and learn about this career. There will be a virtual career fair open to grades 7 through 12 taking place on May 6th. There will be sessions from 8 a.m. to 11 a.m. and 1 to 3 p.m. Whether you are sure this is the career for you or it is just something you want to look into, this is a great learning opportunity. To register, go to michiganccd.vfairs.com or contact them at info at michigancd.com. It only takes a dollar to send off your favorite seniors with a sweet treat. Candy grams are being sold for, for the rest of the week until next Wednesday, May 12th, in front of the main office. Whether you're showing appreciation or letting them know how proud you are, these treats are make, sure to make uh, a senior smile. Coming up, Davidson athletes are making big plays when it comes to their futures. And Seth Momentier has teams are swinging into action for the next few days. We got spirit, yes we do. We got spirit, how about you? School spirit goes beyond the stadiums and is more than just wearing the gear. Here at Davidson, it means sticking together and staying positive. Throughout the year, we need to keep our spirits high and follow the Cardinal Code. It starts with us, Davidson. Only we can make a difference. To show your school spirit, you can help each other, get and stay involved in activities, volunteer, and do little things like hold the door open. We've got school spirit just like you. Go Cards! I got Jimmy Collins on the slam! Some of our Davidson wrestlers competed at the national level and had impressive finishes. G good morning, Davidson. I'm Seth Palmentier. Alex Facundo placed in third at the 2021 UWW Junior Freestyle World Team Trials, while Josh Barr also placed third, but in the 2021 UWW Cadet Freestyle World Team Trials. Great job, guys, and way to represent Davidson at the national level. 
Last week, the JV girls soccer team traveled to Midland to play the Chemex. They battled it out and won the game with goals from Ali Lumsden, who received a perfect pass from Tori Scally. And then Sydney Smith completed a nice shot from a fast breakaway. And to cap off the week, they conquered the DeWitt Panthers 2-1 with a goal apiece from Sydney Smith and Paige Alice. They play Mount Pleasant tomorrow on, on, our home turf, on our home turf, so wish them good luck. The Senior Athletic Signing Ceremony is coming up. It's on Friday, May 21st from 5-7 to 7 in the evening. The Athletic Department sponsored event will be in the DHS Auditorium. Any senior student athlete who has signed a letter of intent can participate, but you must complete a form that can be found in the Athletic Office. We hope to see you there. For upcoming sports, there seems to be an abundance of them scheduled for tomorrow. But first, today at 6.45, girls soccer will, will face Mount Pleasant here at home. Now for tomorrow, baseball and softball are competing at 4. The baseball team will swing on over to Bay City Central, while the softball team will host the Wolves. Girls tennis will also face off at 4. They're heading over to Lapeer to take on the Lightning. And then at 6, girls lacrosse will hit, hit the fields against Midland Dow here at home. And the boys lacrosse team will, take, will end the night here at 7 taking on Midland Dow as well. That's all for sports. Let's switch the topic and start thinking of weather. What do you have for us, Jill? You know, Seth, in all honesty, I'm kind of saddened by the fact that people have been calling my puns bad, but even I have to admit, they're, uh, they're quite terrible. Good morning, Davidson. I'm Jillian Tate. I find myself quite funny, and I'm here to deliver your forecast. Today we have a high of 56 and a low of 36 with some clouds in the morning, but the, sun, er, it, but the sun will be making its appearance in the afternoon. Thursday we're looking at a high of 54 and a low of 32, just a sprinkle of rain in the evening. On Friday we're looking at a high of 51 and a low of 32 with some showers, not a constant flow, but definitely the occasional spurts of rain. On Saturday we're looking at a high of 54 and a low of 39 and it's going to be partly cloudy. With the weather looking pretty consistent for the next four days, there isn't a lot to worry about. Just remember to keep those umbrellas on standby. Jack, take it away. To keep up to date everything Davison, make sure you follow us on Twitter, Instagram, and at DTV underscore official. You can also like us on Facebook at DTV News to watch daily newscasts and much more. Subscribe to the YouTube channel, DTV News. While you're at, at it, visit our website, DTVNews.org. So this week we're talking about teachers that are our favorite that we appreciate and this year I all my teachers are amazing it's really hard to pick who my favorite is um, I think today I'll give a shout out to Miss Palso she always makes teaching so interesting both a push and Civil War which I have this year it's the way she teaches you can really tell she's passionate about it and I just love her class mm. I really love this class I gotta give a shout out to Randy and you know gotta get those brownie points uh, <laughs> you know uh, We'll see you later, Davidson. Have a good day. <laughs>